547 right now. The Hunger Games Catching Fire is now playing in theaters, already getting some rave reviews. Oh, they say it's awesome. Terry Miner saw it. Now, besides getting Jennifer Lawrence to be a household name all around the world, The Hunger Games has also made archery more popular than ever. And our Terry Miners is at King's Archery Outfitters this morning, where they've already seen a spike in business. And I understand you saw the film, Terry. What'd you think? It's phenomenal. You know, they are. I, as soon as the movie was over, I thought, I can't wait for the next one to start. That's how great it was. Oh, you hear arrows going on in here, too. This is Scott King here this morning. Hey, Scott, good to see you. Good morning. This is great training for young people. And you said there's a program in county schools? Uh, yes, sir. The National Archery in the Schools program. It's in our county. It's actually nationwide. It's in all but uh, two states. All right. You were a trainer. So how long do you think Jennifer Lawrence had to take to be able to shoot? Because she looks pretty good shooting in these films. You know, there's no telling. It, it, it's pretty amazing how quickly somebody can take to this. We can have people hitting a target in just a matter of minutes, actually, and you're going to prove that before it's over with today. Is that your son and daughter? Yes, sir, it is. Yeah, they're pretty good at this already. So you think a, you think a Nimrod like me can learn this in, in enough time before this show's off this morning where I can at least shoot an arrow in this room? Absolutely. What is that thing down there in the middle of the floor? We're probably going to kill some zombies, too. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take that out too. All right, and archery, the popularity is rising because of oh, this no film. Doubt. Uh, no doubt. Yeah, the Hunger Games franchise is phenomenal. And this film, guys, that I know they started at midnight last night. Now, I got lucky enough to get a pin. That's a mocking, a mocking jay in there. I'll have to leave it with one of your kids here today. But a mocking jay is sort of the center of attention in this film. Oh, no I doubt. can't ruin any more of this, but we're going to learn a little bit of archery. And are you sure that I'm strong enough to handle Absolutely. this? Absolutely. All right. I'll be coming Archer before the show's over this morning, guys, as we celebrate the opening of Hunger Games Catching Fire here on Good Morning Kentucky Anna. Actually, I did. I nailed this uh, zombie they have at the end of the room, but at the end of the show, I'm going to shoot on here. We're going to see a bunch of young people shooting in a moment or two. Scott King has this place, King's Archery Outfitters, and this is great discipline, too, isn't it? Oh, it is. It is. Uh, the first several years of the Archery in the Schools program, they had statistics that showed that the kids' grades and their confidence, everything went up. Indeed. All right, we're going to watch some of them shoot. And uh, what I learned from Scott a few minutes ago is he put a bow in my hands, and within three minutes or so, I was already able to hit a target. Not very well, but... Uh, we're it, killing zombies. Exactly right. I got a zombie down there at the end of this. And, and that's the same thing for these kids. It only takes a couple minutes, and they can learn at least the basics. Yes, sir. And uh, what's so neat about this sport is, you know, the first place you shot was basically in the closet. Right. And... Uh, that, that's so neat about this is they can get their bows and they can shoot at the house, they can shoot in the basement or the garage or the backyard. Yeah, and uh, these bows are so advanced now. I mean, the sights, everything, you, you adjusted a few things for me, and, and within seconds I was able to get pretty close to that. Correct. That, the, the newer compounds, we can force that, that sighting and that fit. And the recurves, like Miss Lawrence shoots, uh, it's a fun way to shoot as well. A lot of people are going that, that route also. And the thing we don't learn when we're first doing this is you take that, if you watch one of these guys, or you take that uh, right and put it up right by your mouth, or you put that arrow right up by your mouth. Key to archery is doing it the same every time. That's and it. even if somebody's doing it goofy, if they're doing it the same, they'll be consistent. They'll be a good archer. Pretty cool. It's King's Archery Outfitters here on Bardstown Road near the Eastland Shopping Center right yes, over sir. here on the corner. Come on by here and, and visit sometime. You can learn in a couple of minutes. If a dummy like me can, so can you. Terry Miners, we're live here on Good Morning Kentucky, and I will shoot later in the show. Yeah, they cover all ages here, too. You saw Aiden a couple minutes ago. You see him over there? He's three years old. Is that right, Scott? Look at that. He yes, just sir. shot right into the target. Way to go, Aiden. And Scott, you've been teaching me. You mind holding this yes, microphone sir. for a second? So I'll see if I can boot this guy up here real fast, if I learned this properly. There's a zombie right down there, and I'm supposed to just pull back on this guy right here. Is that a sound about right? Yes, sir. Look through my sight and the see fate if... of mankind hangs in the balance. There we go, right? There. Oh, I got him. <laughs> I, got him anyway. I got him a little low, but <laughs> I got him anyway. All right, let's, let's get out of their way and let them shoot. You guys go ahead. Uh, the uh, popularity of this sport has certainly been helped by Hunger Games, right? Oh, absolutely, and a lot of the other movies and, and the Archer in the Schools program, so many things have, have driven people into the store. All right, and th you're, you're using the type of bow that Katniss uses in this movie. This, now, that takes a lot of training, doesn't it? Yes, sir. A recurve is a little harder to shoot, 
Uh, any of the bows that we sell here, we will always walk down range and work with people. Uh, one of the things that's on the advertisement that they mentioned is our Facebook page. And if people can go to there, they can see some things and some particulars about these bows. Uh, but this bow is a little harder to shoot. It's really cool to look at, but it is definitely a little more difficult. All right. And what's your name, young lady? I'm Coco. And you? Alina. Alina. And how long did it take you to learn how to shoot? Um, I, I started two years ago, so... And you enjoy it every day. It's good. It's good. Good discipline, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. And no boys mess with them. That's even better. <laughs> They're shooting away here. Hunger Games, a, a smash hit everywhere, worldwide. And this sport of archery is uh, just, it's a great bit of camaraderie out here, too. You put oh, teams together, schools absolutely. have teams? Yes, sir. A lot of the schools have teams, and, and some of the schools that don't have teams will have clubs. Right. But then there's also, we have shoots here that people can come and hang out, and Saturdays are pretty busy. There's always kids in here shooting. Very nice. All right, when I get into the station later today, guys, apples on the heads. I'm getting better at this stuff. Terry Miner's live here on Good Morning, Kentucky. <laughs>